Hey, it's Liz Carpenter with day 65 of my 15K Formula 90 Day Challenge, and it's just about mm, 40 minutes before I'm supposed to wake up. So um, I'm going to try to make this quick. Um, mm -hmm. As I was like signing the grade papers <laughs> yesterday, or maybe it was yeah yesterday morning, it was funny because um, one of my students had sent me a LinkedIn invitation to my school email address and I went in to decline it um, because it's, it's to my school address and I don't know if that's right or wrong, but you know, I don't have my school address uh, connected to LinkedIn. And the article was on um, sleep deprivation. <laughs> So I took that as a message that I needed to go to sleep. Um, so yeah, I did. I, I only had 20 papers to grade, got them all done. Um, you know, for reason within a reasonable within a reasonable amount of time. Um, mainly because I guess I I had a, a Facebook chat date, if that makes sense. Um, ah, I did, I tried on live food instead of dead food during the day. Totally works. Um, my, my lunch was, uh, mush, a bunch of fruits blended together. And something I learned about, um, juicing, if you do juicing, like you're supposed to drink it like within the first 15 minutes. So I had like this raw honey and different raw foods and I actually had some, some chickpea flour, which doesn't taste too good, but with like all the stuff I had in there, it is okay. So I had brown mush <laughs> for lunch and it, it gave me really um, even energy throughout the day and I was surprised that I wasn't hungry within the next two minutes because like when I eat a salad usually it's like uh, five minutes past and I'm like I'm so hungry so um, salads don't do it for me but um, the different fruits and I had some super green powder in there too that that were uh, and then I had Pizza Hut for dinner, and it killed me. And that's why I'm doing this all late and stuff, because I was laying there trying to recover from Pizza Hut. <laughs> uh, yeah, it's not normal to be tired after eating. I, I'm letting that, like, really sink in deep. It's not normal. Um... At 7, I had a call with Jill Stevens, who is teaching me how to be a better uh, tutor and coach. So I have coaching for productivity, and I have coaching for business. <laughs> and so I've become uh, this vision that I had for um, a real coach, Anna, and it was kind of a joke. Uh, and I have to share it again. I had made this YouTube channel called Coach Anarin, and it was supposed to be kind of a parody on coaches um, because I had a running coach, I had a life coach, and I had a business coach. And the idea was I was promoting these people, you know, through the show, but it's kind of a joke because, like, I needed a coach for everything, and I'm supposed to be, you know, this great coach. At the time, I was just making fun of coaching. I had no idea that I would become a coach. So, oh, the irony. Um, yeah, so Jill, Jill Stevens, thank you, thank you, thank you um, for just creating a coaching program where people can plug in and get focused and get moving on what they're doing. Now, uh, the way I've been progressing pretty fast with Jill's program is um, she has the modules already set up online and she has like um, bi-weekly or every month in a while she have a bonus support call. And in the morning rush, which for me starts in about 40 minutes, I'll take about 30 minutes each day and just um, work on one of the modules in the classroom. 
and it's been it's been really good like in those little 30 minutes because you know you only have 30 minutes you work really hard um and about this facebook chat thing so so for the last two days and i i guess tomorrow too <laughs> i i've been chatting with my um sweetheart on facebook and the there's a there's um kind of a hmm, how do i put it the effect is kind of like ah oh, euphoria yay but afterwards it's like i can't focus on anything but him and i'm like i'm, I'm trying to get like my mind together like Okay, let's get back to work, but no, I, I float away into La La Land and I'm trying to like figure a way out to manage this because I meet with him at seven. Um, so I don't know, I might actually just have to adjust my schedule again to move things up before seven is like I have the morning rush, get everything in before 12, and now for my less important things, I think I need to get them in before 7. Uh, okay. Um, Ryan Dunn. <laughs> I, I just like, Ryan Dunn, I just clicked on your Super Saiyan badass hangout from, I think it was like two days ago. I wanted to go, but, you know, I had other engagements that prevented me from attending, um, or I should say, I went to other events that I had actually purchased instead of going to your free Google Hangout, and, you know, I really appreciated a lot of the things you said, and I love you and, and Jomo, you guys are awesome, um, they, they were talking about belief and conviction, belief in yourself, conviction in what you're doing, and, um, taking all your learning and applying it and so it really resonated with me just the idea of like get off of the the learning cycle where you're constantly learning and learning and learning and not do anything with your knowledge and Ryan recommended a book called Butterflies Are Free to Fly I've never heard of this book so you know <laughs> I'm gonna add it to the list and I think I'll, uh, I'll get to it maybe next year because my list is really long. But I am reading a little bit each morning now because I uh, implemented this morning rush thing. So um, I know I will get to it. All right, so uh, let me see if there's anything else here. Ha ha ha. The, the book takes you from the perspective of life is happening to us instead of um, the book takes you from the perspective of life is happening to us instead and moves you to life is happening from us and take a hundred percent responsibility for everything that has happened in your life so far hundred percent responsibility I'm so all about that I'm fully responsible for um, not getting that guest post up Annis yet <laughs> I've been willfully distracted from the game and um, yeah I'm getting a um, manage on that only now but thank you for reminding me I appreciate that too and definitely tomorrow because um, I'm actually going to sleep a little bit earlier today than I did yesterday um, all right that's it for me, day 65. Check out my app. It's a personal development app. Um, video on demand delivered to you on any subject you want to improve on. And also, it gives you an opportunity to make money for just being a part of the app community. Okay, so I'll see you in the next video.